Hey guys, it's Shannon and Paul. And today we're here with a brand new series of Lego minifigures. Woo! This is series 20 and it looks awesome. Yes, it does. I just want to let you know here at PS Toy Reviews, we're Lego masters. <laughs> <laughs> because we know how to build minifigures. Yes, sometimes. <laughs> That's Watch. The... <laughs> There's going to be some weird part in here that, make, that befuddles us. <laughs> That's the extent of our Lego master knowledge. I had to throw that in there. What's yeah. the show called? Brick Masters or is it Lego Masters? We like watching that show on TV. I can't now, think of... I, what is it? I don't know. I, it's Lego Masters. Okay. So, Series 20, there are 16 different figures to collect. They all look like they are wearing some sort of interesting costume or outfit, which will be really cool. There's some really fun ones on here. Um, I really want Paul <laughs> to get the peas because, hmm. you know, Paul loves peas so oh, much. Oh, yeah. Okay. Let's go ahead and get started. Is there a person that you are most hoping to find? So, yeah, a lot of these are awesome. I really would like the knight. I always, uh, the knights and the fantasy theme have always been one of my favorites. Um, of course, the Kitar person. Um, yeah. Oh, I want her. Okay. All right. Yeah, I'm going to go, I'm going to go with the, the knight. I figured you'd want this one right here. The little, like, Viking. I do dude. want that one, uh, but if I've got to pick somebody, the knight is probably going to be the one I want the most. So, okay, you get a checklist inside, which is going to show you those people. Oh, it looks like I got the guitar person. Oh, nice. Okay. Let's see who I get. I like these packages. They're really I do too. metallic -y. Yeah. Okay. Oh, no. I might have your knight. Okay. It's so, you. Yeah. <laughs> I'm, I'm going to call this Miami Vice guitar guy. Or Paul from the 80s. Yeah, because this is definitely an 80s person, so I love the hot pink pants, <laughs> has a tour jacket on, leather jacket. It's got the mullet <laughs> going on. And then of course the guitar. That's awesome. The little shirt with the lightning bolt on. It's cool. So yeah, this is a really cool figure. I like this a lot, but it does scream Miami Vice 1980s. I love that the guitar is now like a Lego accessory. Yeah. That's awesome. Yep. Okay. I have Paul's knight. Yes. It's the crow knight, mm -hmm. the bird knight. Um, he is pretty awesome. I like the yellow and black, like, opposites of his uniform. Yeah. He has a little... Yeah, Harley Quinn is his fashion consultant. <laughs> yeah. He has, um, what is that, just like armor plating? Yeah. Or his fancy necklace. That's right. That's what, he, yeah. he has a sword and the shield, and I like his facial expression. When you take the helmet off, you can kind of oh, see... Oh, yeah, that's a good-looking... Uh, Lego face. Yeah, I really like that. Does he the, have two faces? Nope, just, just one, one face, okay. but I really like all that like facial hair. He looks really tough. He does. Let me hold this up just to make sure you can see his facial hair that yeah, we're talking he's, about. Yeah, that's a good looking figure. Yeah, when the helmet is on, which the helmet is awesome by the way, but when the helmet's on, all you see are his eyes. Yep. So. And I like that he's got the crow. That means he says, caca! Or other people might say, you know nothing, John Crow. <laughs> Okay. Little Game of Thrones reference there. You are up. All right. Oh, funny. Okay, I just got the knight as well, so we're going to start building our crow knight army. Go again. All right. Oh, this one feels a little bit heavier. Maybe, maybe, just, maybe I'm just thinking it feels that way. Well, no, it has an extra bag okay, of parts. Okay, we've got an extra bag. Okay, so I have the uh, the pinata guy nice. with the sombrero. And I have, ooh, the boombox person, maybe. Yep. Okay, I have the boombox girl. She is in action. In case you haven't seen the minifigures yet, some of them are now coming with these, like, bases that allow you to kind of put them in action poses as I break her off the base. I was going to show you, like, you know, you can make her, like, walking or just kind of however however you want. Um, now she's like, <laughs> check out that pose. Yeah. yeah. Okay, so she is really, really awesome. I like her little boom box here, and I like that her hair and hat are actually one molded piece. So when you put it on, it kind of tilts her hat to the side. Oh, I had no idea it was that yep. way. It's just... That's cool. It's one piece. So yep. <laughs> I think that's pretty cool. I yep. like her a lot. Okay. I have the pinata guy. 
So this is actually a shorter minifigure. So it's probably a kid at a birthday party. He's got on his festive sombrero. Should be filled with nachos in my opinion, but <laughs> um, he's got his little uh, poncho thingy on, his pinata whacking stick. And of course there's the pinata. I really like that pinata. Yeah. I wish like it had a part that could undo at the bottom and like little Lego pieces could spill out. That'd be cool. Oh, that'd be fun. Okay. So pinata guy. All right. Next round. I have the, oh, oh the keytar. The keytar person. Yep, go again. So go again. Try again. Next up is whoa, that is a lot of pieces, and they've it's, got a turtle. They got a turtle. Ooh, a piece. Hanging around there at the top. Let's see. And what do I have? I have somebody new. I've got a blue cape. Oh, I got the Viking guy. Okay. I have the diver or turtle rescue. Turtle, turtle rescue park worker. Yeah. She is really cool. She is wearing a short wetsuit, like not a full wetsuit. They're like the shorts version. Um, I say she because she does have eyelashes. So she has a little piece of turtle food, I'm assuming, some sort of kelp or something. She has this awesome little sea turtle here, which is pretty cute. And then her helmet has a snorkel and the little goggles, but you can flip it up or down. I like how well that works. Very cool. So I like her. Yep. And I have the turtle hunter. No, that's not the turtle hunter. <laughs> so I have a Viking guy, I'm assuming. I love the orange beard. Um, he's got his shield right there, which is really cool. The long spear. Turtle Let's hunter. <laughs> There's his face without the helmet on. It looks really cool. It does. He's got this nice cloth cape. So cool. We got the Viking and the turtle rescue person. All right. I'm going to go next. Come on, karate dude. Oh, I might've gotten it. No, mm, no. Uh, no, okay, I got the, I got the, the Olympic athlete guy. Okay. So, okay, cool. Ooh, this one has, hang on, shake it off camera there. There's something all the way to the top of this. Mm. What do we have here? Let's see. Something in a bag. Did I just get the same thing? Oh, it's stuck. Yep, okay, the Viking. I have the Viking guy. So let me go again. Viking it and liking it. <laughs> I have. Oh no, the turtle, turtle rescue dude. person. Okay, go again. That was a do that. Yeah. Turtle do that. Ooh. Now I have. Somebody knew. No, it's the knight. The knight. Oh man. Go again. Okay, hold on. Okay. I'm losing pieces here. Uh-oh. Let me stick his pieces back in the bag. Okay. Um, that's a lot of duplicates in a row. Yeah. Now, the nice thing about that is you can always trade if you get duplicates, or a lot of these figures you need more than one of. Oh, cool. A new one. Got the bunny girl. Okay. So here is our, I'm going to call it the Olympic oh, competitor. Yeah, like a discus thrower. Yeah, so we've got a discus and we've got a javelin. Nice. He's like... I was the first javelin thrower. <laughs> okay. So this is actually a really cool figure. She's got her medal. It looks like it's a bronze medal, which may be why she's got the angry face. Over here, you can flip it around. She's... And now it's a gold medal. <laughs> now it's a gold medal. Happy face. So very cool. So we've created a whole new event where you throw the discus and then the javelin all at the same event. There you go. Usually those are two different events. <laughs> Okay, and then I have the adorable little girl, like, ready for bed. She's wearing little pink bunny print pajamas, and she has the biggest bunny friend here. Yes. I love that bunny friend accessory. That's really cool. It is so awesome. I think she got this at Costco, because around the holidays they sell giant stuffed bears that are almost as big as kids or yeah. bigger than kids. I think that's where she got that. Good day. Okay, next. Do I get somebody new? No, Keytar guy again. The 
This is somebody new. Okay, I have, oh, the rocket guy. Space camp dude. Okay. I have a checklist. I have a pinata dude. Pinata. Now I have... Oh, the drone Ooh, pilot. Oh, somebody new. All right, here is the drone pilot. <laughs> that drone is awesome. Yes. I like the way that looks. Now, he's not a very good drone pilot because if I remove the drone or remove him from the base, you can see he has a Band-Aid <laughs> on his face. He must have flown the drone into his face. Drone flies. So... <laughs> Tough. Yeah, so he's a beginner drone flyer. I like he's wearing a little hoodie jacket there. Yep. Okay, I have the NASA Space Camp person who is absolutely awesome. The detail in this figure is incredible. I love the NASA piece on the model rocket right here. She's got, she's got a wrench. She's another one of those figures with the hat attached to the hair, <laughs> which is pretty cool. And then I like the detail, the ponytail coming out of the, like out of where the hat would clip on and then the hair tie around the ponytail. She's got two different faces because, well, safety first. <laughs> she got goggles Cute. on. Okay, I really like the printing on the chest. That's the vintage uh, Lego space theme. And then down there with the planet, that's another one. And then she comes with this. Oh, Paul's gonna sneeze. Bless you, Paul. <laughs> Pardon me, this blueprint that makes you sneeze. <laughs> um, it's she's got a little, season Yeah, here. she's got a little blueprint of the rocket so she can see what adjustment she has to make with the wrench. So awesome. that is such a cool minifigure. That is. All right. Okay, I think we have 10 out of the 16 so far. Is that right? That is correct. It looks to me like we still need the Red Power Ranger, the Peas, the Karate Guy. Uh, the Llama. The or Llama. The, the Pirate. The, the Pirate and the Green Lego Brick Guy. Okay, come on. Yay! Hey, you got the Llama. Nice. Wow. First try. Yeah, good job. Just like Lego Batman. And I have... Okay, I've got the breakdancing girl that Shannon already got. So that's a duplicate. I have another the breakdancing girl that Shannon got. <laughs> another duplicate. You like that one. I do. I have... I think this is somebody new. Yeah, I've got the Red Power Ranger. Awesome. Cool. Okay, this is the guy I am calling the Red Power Ranger. I have no <laughs> idea if it is or not, but boy, it looks like it. So I love the suit. I like the helmet with the little V accessory up there. And the green laser sword is really cool. Yes, it is. That's unique. Yeah. So very cool. All right. Okay, and I have a Lama Love or Alpaca... Associates. <laughs> llama Love and Alpaca Associates. I don't know the difference between a llama and al an alpaca. I always forget. But I think this is a llama. I'm going with llama. It's a costume because it's our girl here. She does have two different expressions. And she has and a, a zipper. little zipper on the back of her outfit there. And she's <laughs> holding a carrot, which she's either going to eat later or go feed to a horse. We're not sure. Cute. Okay. See if four we can... to go? Yeah, four to go. Okay, I have turtle rescue person. Next, I have... Oh, karate guy. Nice. So that's new. Okay. Come on, pirate girl. Come on, pirate girl. Who's this? That is... <gasps> oh, no! It's the one Paul needed. It's nope, the peas. No, it's the peas. Okay, we're not really sure why, but she has an apple. <laughs> so, I'm going to take that apple off so you can see the pea costume even better. I love that pea pod. She has two peas, and her face is where the third pea would be. Now, if you take that costume off... She has two different expressions. This one, she has green lipstick, which I think is really cool. Or this expression, she's still kind of got the green lipstick, but she's just like cheesy all smiles. Yep. 
Now, she has this little symbol. It kind of looks like leaves and maybe apples in this little heart dish. But she's a pea person, so I'm not sure. You guys will have to leave a comment and fill me in on why the apple and the peas. The but, apples and the peas get together and make a civic organization called the Pea Patrol. Ah, uh, maybe. Yep. Or Produce Patrol. Okay, I, I have Karate Guy. Um, so he's really cool. He would actually be Nunchuck Guy because it was a Karate Guy way back in series two of the Legomai figures. Wax on, wax off. Yep. Daniel son. Okay. <laughs> so he's got a black belt, which will hold your pants up just as well as any other color belt. Um, I uh -huh. love the little nunchucks he has. Yeah. He's so, neat. He is. So he's got the grin going on. He also has the concentration face. Oh, I like it with the headband. Yeah. So that way you don't, you got to concentrate when you're working nunchucks. Yep. You don't want to whack yourself in the head with them. He's going to have to borrow band-aids from yeah. the drone controller. Yeah, exactly. All right, we'll put him right there. All right, we have two more people okay, pirate that we need to get. Lego brick tent. Yeah. It's 10. Is it maybe the 10th anniversary of minifigures? No, they've been around for a lot longer than that. I don't okay, know this is the drone pilot. Okay. All right. This could take a while. Yeah. This is the drone pilot. You gotta show them. They can't see. Oh, Even sorry. You can see what's in there. Okay. This is the NASA Lego okay. person. Here, I'm gonna take turns. Yeah. With you. Okay, I have the Power Ranger dude. Okay, this is the orange at the John Crow Game of Thrones guy. <laughs> Come on. Oh no, it's the pinata person. Pinata person. Pinata power. Okay. This is the uh, nunchuck. Okay. Wow, mine won't open. Okay, I have. Who's this? Oh, nunchuck it's the guy. nunchuck person. Whoa. Oh no. He lost his head. Yes, he did. This is. Ooh, ooh, ooh. I got Lego Green Brick Guy. All right. Maybe Paul can rescue my guy's head. Yep. Thank got you. It. No problem. Okay, I'm hunting for the pirate girl. This is not it. That's another drone operator. Okay. To Paul. Uh, where would she be? Now, I do want to let you, Shannon, know, as well as viewers know, this was not a full box. Oh, no. She might not there be here. There was six packs missing. The box looked completely unsearched. That's uh, the NASA space rocket person. Um, the box looked completely unsearched, so I have no reason to believe that. Did somebody buy my pirate girl? They might have, but I don't think so. Find out. I got her! You got pirate her. girl! Here is Miss Swan. <laughs> Here is our pirate buccaneer swashbuckler. Person. I don't know what she is. Yep. She is awesome, though, yes, is she what is. she is. I like she has a little beauty mark on her face. She has cool black and, like, burgundy striped pants. And then she has um, all these, like, belts and shoulder harness things. And she is wielding two swords because yep. two are better than one. Two sabers. Yep. She's like, I can have two at once. Yep. So, awesome. All right. And then I have a Lego Green Brick Guy. So what's the 10 for? So, it, you know, it may be the 10th anniversary of minifigures. I jumped to say that it wasn't. So it's 2020, 2010. I feel like, I feel like minifigures have been around longer than that. Well, not minifigures, obviously, but maybe not these minifigure series. I feel like the series have been around longer I than that. I don't know. It's the 10th anniversary of something. Yeah, I'm, I don't know. 10th anniversary of green six top Legos. <laughs> maybe. Maybe that's what it is. Yeah, the 2 by 3 green Lego. <laughs> I don't know. But I love this piece that says 10, real big on it. So, cool. We got the full series. Okay, we ended up getting the full series. It was touch and go there for a couple of minutes <laughs> at the end. But we got them all. They're so cool. They are really cool. This, 
I always say it, but I'm like, this may be one of my favorite series of Lego minifigures, and this one really may be. Um, <laughs> this time it might actually be true. <laughs> yeah, they all are at the time. Well, yeah, because at the time, that's the newest one you have. That's right. Okay. Shannon, who's your favorite figure going to be? So seriously, I like so many of these, but you're going to have to come all the way back down to my end. Mm. Keep going, keep going, keep going. Shout out to the pirate girl, but I'm going with the peas. The peas. Okay. Yep, the peas. All right, the peas. Okay, I'm going to go. I really love this knight. I love the face underneath that helmet. Um, I think, huh, who do I want? I think I'm going to go with this NASA, the space camp girl. I really like that one. I love all the cool pieces that that one comes with. So I'm going with that one. How about you guys? Which one of these did you like the best? Leave a comment down below. Let us know. Leave the video a thumbs up if you enjoyed it. Hit the share button and make sure to subscribe if you haven't already. That will make you part of the PS Toy Reviews crew where we love life-size bunnies. Thanks so much for watching. We'll see you guys next time. Bye, guys.